Harmony OS, Huawei's latest and greatest operating system set out to compete against Android OS and iOS. I first tried it on the MatePad Pro last year and more recently on the Huawei P50 Pro. So here are some of my favorite things about Harmony OS which make it a little bit special. Up first we have the OS look and feel. Harmony OS has a very minimalistic and sleek look to it. I like how fluid and dynamic the OS feels when you're navigating through it and interacting with it. Everything about the device feels so smooth, almost like the UI is alive. Whether that's the look of the home screen, how you can customize your wallpapers and your widgets, and the snippets. The widget snippets were one of the cooler things I saw on this UI and I haven't really seen many other companies do that. Rather than having widgets pinned to your home screen occupying different spots, you have the ability to swipe up on the application that supports the snippet widget and customize what type of widget you want to view in that snippet form. Meaning that on any given application that supports this, you can swipe up and get a quick viewable widget that can be dismissed just by tapping away from the application. The snippet can be customized and saved in different ways and can be accessed every time you swipe up on the application. If you wish to pin the widget, you can quite easily do that as well. This way you retain the screen space, but also have quick access to those snippet widgets. That's obviously one of the highlights, but all around just using the Harmony OS just feels very nice, dynamic and fluid. Next up, we have connectivity for seamless cross-device experience. Harmony OS offers an enriched multi-device control panel to connect and control different devices. With just a swipe down from the top right corner to access the control center, it extends the connection from a single device, the super device, to multiple devices around it. This provides a seamless and smooth connection and pairing experience. With different devices that use the same Huawei ID, simply connect them by dragging and dropping them to the main device. Now this widget can be accessed under the control panel of the device where the icon of the main device is encircled by the other connectable devices. It's sort of like different bubbles floating around with different devices to your main core device and whatever you swipe and connect it's gonna pair that up easily. The interface also presents the connection status of the device in a more intuitive way rather than the traditional text way of viewing it. I've been using this to connect up the P50 Pro with all these other devices super seamlessly whether that's the MatePad Pro, whether that's the MateBook 14S and the connection is so stable and quick every single time. I can access my phone using the laptop or the tablet without having to touch this even while I'm using it. So pretty awesome. Another really great addition to that is the multi-cam support which works in a similar sort of way. There's a button down there with a camera icon that you can tap on. If you have multiple devices that support this, say for example I had multiple P50 Pros, I could connect the cameras on those and use it as a director view to switch between different cameras in different locations to get like multiple camera support like people have on bigger budgets. Pretty insane. Finally and of course we have the multi-screen collaboration. This is potentially one of the best things about the Huawei Harmony OS ecosystem. You can easily set up multi-screen collaboration where you connect your smartphone to a PC or tablet to form a powerful smart office, smart device sort of link for perfect multitasking. Your smartphone can also function as a wirelessly controlled external storage unit from the PC by accessing its storage contents. So whether you want to share files, videos and images, it's quite easy to do that with a simple drag and drop feature. Whether that's going from your tablet to your phone, your tablet to your laptop, your laptop to your phone, all of that is possible. The potential with this is truly endless and I can only wait to see how much more this improves. We've done a full video dedicated to the multi-screen collaboration, so check that out if you guys are interested in that. These are just some of the top features on Harmony OS that I personally really liked. There's obviously a lot more out there, probably a lot more to list down in such a short video, but these are my favorite features to look out for. So there you guys go. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, a like would be appreciated. Consider subscribing for more content just like this. And I'll be seeing you again in the next video. Until then. Bye.